Fighting a ticket in court. One. Your Honor, I'd like to challenge this ticket. What is your reason for challenging this ticket? The police officer did not have the right to issue the ticket. Can you explain what you mean with that statement? I was rightfully parked. He told me that I was parked in a handicap space. Well, was it a handicap space? It used to be. It is not not anymore. Well, was there a sign letting you know it was a handicap space? No, because the spot has since been removed. So, did you explain to the officer that it was no longer a handicap space? I tried, but he wouldn't listen. He said I was trying to get away from paying. Thank you. I will question the officer and get his side of the story. Fighting a ticket in court, too. I can't pay for the ticket. Why can't you pay for the ticket? Well, I just got laid off from my job. Okay, Mr. Richardson, I'm going to have to give you an alternative. What do you mean? I'm going to have to give you 36 hours of community service. Thank you for the opportunity, Your Honor. You will report to the nearest community service center. They will tell me where to go? Yes, they will give you an option of places to go. Thank you, Your Honor. I greatly appreciate it. You're welcome. I hope you don't plan on returning to this courtroom anytime soon. Learning how to drive. One. The first thing you want to do is fasten your seat belt. Check. What's next? Check your mirrors and make sure you can see behind you. Done. Should I put it in reverse now? Yes. Ease off the brake slowly. Okay. I need to turn to leave the parking lot. Make sure there are no pedestrians walking behind you. Okay. Do I turn the steering wheel to the left? Yes, make sure you are paying attention to the cars. Will do. Do I put it in drive now? Yes, but remember, have your foot on the brake and then ease it off. Wow, this seems easy. Let's go out on the street. Learning how to drive, too. Where should my hands be on the steering wheel? Your hands should be on 10 and 2. 10 and 2? What do you mean? Think of the steering wheel as a clock. Put your hands on 10 and 2. Oh, okay. What about my eyes? Should I be looking at the signs? Take a quick glance at the signs, but always look in front. When do I have to use my horn? You should use your horn for an emergency. What about if someone cuts me off? That's not an appropriate use of your horn. Am I ready to start driving yet? No, you need to learn some more of the basics. Getting a parking ticket. Sir, is this your car? Yes, are you giving me a ticket? Unfortunately, yes, I am. Read the sign. Which sign? I don't see a sign. The sign above you, sir. So what? It says we can't park on Mondays. Yes, it does. Although it also says that you can't park without a permit. I didn't see that. Well, I'm sorry, but I still have to give you the ticket. Can't you just give me a warning? I'm sorry, but I already started writing the ticket. Fine, give me the ticket. I'll fight it in court. Getting the driver's license. Finally, I got my driver's license. Congratulations, can I see it? Sure, here it is. I don't like my picture. Oh, wow, you blinked. Yeah, they didn't want to take another picture. I didn't know your middle name was David. Oh, no, I didn't want anyone to know. Well, you shouldn't have put it on your license. I had to. When are you going to get your license? I was thinking about going tomorrow to the DMV. You want me to take you? I do have my license now. Sure. Pick me up from the house at noon. Calling the insurance company. Hello. I was in an accident earlier today. Okay. Did you get the appropriate information from the other driver? Yes, I did. Just tell me what you need. It would be better if you came into the office. When can I come in? 
You can come in tomorrow. What time works for you? I can make it in tomorrow at noon. Great. Can you give me your full name? Yes, it's David Mark. Okay, Mr. Mark. I have you scheduled for tomorrow at noon. Sounds good. I will see you tomorrow. Please remember to bring all the information you got from the other driver. A traffic incident. What's going on? What happened? I'm sorry, I wasn't paying attention. Well, I'm going to need your information. Yes, I know. I'm sorry. I was distracted with the car accident. I figured. Well, here is my information. Let me get my information. I have it in my car. Yes, please do that. Well, it seems like I don't have my insurance card. How could you not have your insurance information? I drive another car. I must have left it in that one. Fine. Let me get your information. Sure. Call me later today. I will give you my information. Calling a traffic school. Hello. I need to make an appointment. Were you mandated by the court to go to traffic school? Yes, I was. Does that matter? Yes, it does. Let me have your full name. It's David Johnson. What days do you have available? We have Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. Oh, okay. okay. I can make it on Thursday. What time should I be in? Come in at 9 a.m. If you can't make it during that time, please call. Great. I will see you this Thursday. Remember to bring your court papers. We need to sign those. I seem to have lost them. Could I go to court to get another copy? Yes, go to the court and print them out before you come over. Failing to stop at a stop sign. Do you know why I stopped you? No, officer. Why? You failed to stop at the stop sign. I'm sorry, officer. I didn't see the stop sign. Have you had anything to drink? No, I have not. Do you need to see my license? Yes, I need your license and registration. Okay, here is my paperwork. I will be back. I need to check your background. Sure thing, officer. Everything seems to be in order. I'm going to give you a warning. Thank you, officer. I'll be more careful. Applying for a driving permit. Hello, I'm number G85. How may I help you today? I would like to apply for my driving permit. Are you 16 years old? That's the minimum age. Yes, I am. Here's my ID. Thank you. May I see your form? Oh, of course. Would I be able to take the written today? If you have the $30, then yes, you can take it. Oh, I must have forgotten my money at home. Well, you can make an appointment to take it tomorrow. That sounds like a good idea. Okay, I will set up the appointment. Passing the road test. Dad, I passed my driving test. You did? That's great news. Where do you want to go first, Dad? You're going to take me out for a ride? Yes, where do you want to go? How about we go and get you a nice steak dinner? That sounds great. I could go for a nice steak around now. Come to the house and pick me up. Would I be able to drive myself? No, you have to drive with someone over the age of 21. Oh, okay. Well, we can drop off my friend that took me to the DMV. Sure, we can go drop him off before we leave. A car accident. Hello, officer. I want to report a car accident. What was the cause of the accident? The other driver had been drinking. Are there any casualties? No, both drivers are fine. Where did the accident take place? It's on the corner of 5th and Vine Street. How many people are involved in the accident? There are two cars. Each car has two people in the vehicle. We will respond as soon as possible. Thank you. Can you hurry? It looks like one of the drivers wants to leave. We will get there as soon as possible. Paying the ticket fine. So, how much is the ticket going to cost? 
Well, it's going to be $200. $200 for a parking ticket? Well, it looks like this is your third parking ticket. Yes, but I haven't gotten one in a couple of months. This is your third parking ticket this year. I know. Fine. I will pay the ticket. How will you be paying the ticket? I will be paying in cash. So that'll be $200 in cash. Yes, let me get you your receipt. Thank you. Have a nice day. Paying off parking tickets. Dad, I got a parking ticket at school. Well, you should pay it off as soon as possible. Where can I pay it off? You can go to downtown and go to the court there. Can I pay it off online? Yes, you can. Look at the fine. It should give you a website. Oh, okay. Let me go to get the ticket. It's in my car. Hurry, because I need to leave for work. Oh, wait. I forgot. I put it in my wallet. Well, take it out, look in the back, and it should give you a website. Yes, it's in the back. Am I going to pay with my debit card? Yes, do you have the money to pay? Taking the written test. Before you take your written test, we need to take your picture. Okay, where do I go? I can take the photo. Stand behind the red line, please. Where do I go to take the test? Go on the other side of the wall and pick a stall. Sounds good. May I have a pencil? Sure, the pencils are on the front desk. Where do I obtain the test? They will give you your test. Remember, eyes on your own test. Of course. This reminds me of school. Yeah, we get that a lot. Will they let me know if I pass the test or not? Yes, they will let you know after you finish. Where to park on campus? Excuse me, this is my first time on campus. Where can I park? There are three parking lots on campus. Can you point me to the direction of the nearest one? Keep driving straight. When you get to the light, make a left. Thank you. Do I have to pay? The first floor has visitors parking. So do I have to pay? Do they take credit cards? Yes, you would have to pay, and they do take credit cards. How much does it cost to park? I believe it is $3. I could be wrong. Oh, okay. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Have a nice day. Driving through a red light. Where do you want to go to eat? I'm not sure. Wait, watch out! The light is red! Oh, damn. Well, there. I passed it. I think there was a cop at that light. Can you check? Look behind you. I don't see anything. Wait, there is a car turning the corner. Is it a police car? Well, is it? Oh, no. I think it is. Well, hopefully he doesn't stop us. Oh, no. He just turned on his lights. Damn. I have to pull over. Yes. I hope I don't get a ticket. Talking to the traffic school instructor. Thank you for coming in today. I'll see you next week. Excuse me, instructor. May I speak with you for a moment? Sure thing, Mr. Davis. What can I help you with? Well, about next week. I can't make it. That is a problem. You are mandated by court to attend every week. I know, but I have a family emergency. You have to go to the court and ask for an extension. Do I have to come back over here after? No, they will give you a makeup date. Great. Thank you for all your help. Sure thing. I hope everything is all right. Thanks. I'll see you next time. Failing the road test. Unfortunately, you made a lot of mistakes, and I cannot pass you. What mistakes did I make? You failed to put on your turn signals when turning a corner. How many mistakes am I allowed? You are allowed three mistakes. You got five. Which other mistakes did I make? You hit the curb when you were parallel parking. I thought you might have missed that. No, you also didn't pay attention to some, some of the signs. Which signs are you talking about? 
You passed a yield sign and did not yield. Can I take the test again? You can take it again on Monday.